In the experiment, babies between 9 and 12 months are placed on a large, plexiglass-topped table. Half of the table has a checkerboard pattern, just underneath the surface, which the baby thinks is plenty safe to crawl on. But halfway across is a visual cliff, which the baby can tell drops off steeply. The plexiglass top continues, so we know it's perfectly fine to proceed. But the baby isn't so sure. And this is a big drop for a baby just starting to crawl. She wants to get across to get the toy. But she's learned to be cautious from dealing with stairs and such. This is where the adult comes in. In this particular investigation, what we attempted to understand is the extent to which the nonverbal facial communication coming from the mother to the child powerfully affected that baby's behavior. If the mother is posing a fear face, the baby typically does not cross this stair step downward, this modified visual cliff or visual step. On the other hand, if the mother poses a smile uh, or somehow poses a nonverbal communication that is not prohibitive but encouraging, the child is much more likely to cross over to her. This particular study demonstrates the role of nonverbal communication in um, determining the child's behavior in uncertain contexts.